What's going on, Thunder Nation? Welcome back, and we're so close to getting ready for the start of the season. Excited to have Jay Dickman joining us. Jay just announced uh, that you're coming back here to Wichita. Looking forward to having you once again. Yeah, I'm looking forward to being back. Uh, I can't wait to see all the fans and uh, be back down in Wichita. I know earlier this summer you decided to try going overseas. Can you elaborate on that experience and what led you back here to Wichita? Yeah, it was a good experience. Um, you know, there were some things that came up that I needed to be home for, and uh, I came home. And uh, so I'm excited to be back in Wichita. Um, obviously, I wish things could have worked out, but uh, they didn't. And, um, you know, I'm taking taking this opportunity to come back and bring a winning season back to Wichita. Um, we got a good group of guys. Uh, coaching staff's always been good. Um, we got one of the best coaches in the league and, uh, he's brought in a lot of guys from last year that, uh, we had the trades and we got some good players coming in and we got some young players coming in and I think we're going to be very deep. Why don't we revisit last season for you? You had a terrific season in terms of, of points and, and everything else on the ice. What, what worked best for you? Do you feel like, uh, that kind of showed up? You know, I think it's I think it's just like playing time, um, getting that confidence back. Um, you know, coming in from my first year in Wichita, uh, and then going into my second year, uh, I just I had a lot of confidence. Um, and then just just been working over the summer, skating wise, um, puck protection, uh, shooting the puck a little more. Um, but you know, it's it starts with like the coaching staff and teaching you different little things about how to play the game. And uh, for every player, there's something different that they need to do. And if you can take on that role and adjust your game a little bit, um, you know, it, it helps a lot. And uh, you'll have a lot of success, uh, especially when you listen to these guys. Um, and playing with two line mates, Cronella. I mean, Cronella was scoring the scoring machine. So pretty much all you had to do is get – get him the puck and puck was going to the back of the net. It, um, and then Carter Johnson up the middle, um, you know, he's, he's very good. Uh, he's in the right spots at the right times. Uh, and he likes, he moves the puck and gets open and that works really well. Um, and then we had Fournier for a little bit and, uh, Fournier and I have always connected, um, two big bodies work down low, um, you know, and tire out the defenseman and then get the puck to the net. Um, we just work our low game and, uh, you know, just getting pucks to the net, um, getting in front uh, is a big success. But uh, I think most of it's just confidence. Two of the three of those uh, guys are going to be back this coming season. The only one, unfortunately, that decided to go somewhere else was Peter Cornell. You're going to be excited to have Steph back and also Carter Johnson. Yeah, I'm excited to see those guys back. I'm excited to see Watts back, um, you know, and Boots. Boots is a good uh, addition. Um, and I'm excited to see all the guys, uh, especially the guys from last year. Uh, there's a few There's a few guys that are still here, and uh, I'm excited for it. Um, I'm so excited to see the coaching staff again, um, the ownership. Uh, the fans are the most important thing. Uh, we got some good fans there. And just uh, – being able to reconnect with them. Jay Dickman joining us. Jay, uh, how'd your off season go so far up until this point? Off season has been good. Um, you know, just been doing a little, little yard work, landscaping, um, a lot of golfing as usual. Um, you know, and took a, took a couple trips, um, obviously one to Europe, but, uh, family and I went to, uh, Myrtle beach for two weeks. Uh, you know, just spent some time on the water. I spent some time on the golf course. Um, and just hanging out with the dogs, family, uh, my new, new nephew, um, you know, getting to see him is always fun, uh, babysitting him and stuff. So it's been a good summer. Uh, I'm excited to get back and ramped up and I've already been playing quite a few games. So I'm excited to get back. Did you cut your, uh, your score down? Cut some strokes off, uh, off that handicap. Uh, yeah, I did. Um, uh, but right now I took about two, three months off. Uh, <laughs> so 
hopefully it's getting up before I get to the get to the courses so I don't have to give too many strokes to the guys. Win some money, maybe. Well, I've been told there's a couple of the newer players that uh, are pretty good at golf, so you're going to have your hands full. Perfect. That's, <laughs> that's exactly what we want. We want some competition when we're golfing. Jay Dickman joining us. Uh, Jay, what are your goals for this coming season? Uh, I want to come in with a um, leadership type thing. Um, I want to want to help some of these young guys. I know we got got a few young guys on the team and, you know, I'll just give them pointers, help them out. Uh, if they have any questions, um, they make sure they know they're feel free to ask. Um, Cause I think the, the older guys that we do have are very, are very good vets. And um, you know, it's, it's the wisdom that you can take from the older guys um, for those young guys. Uh, and obviously, you know, I'll just uh, bring in a, bring in a big, big body and uh, hopefully keep the points, keep producing like I was, um, you know, and have good success. And I want to get this team back on a, on a winning streak and, get into playoffs and uh, see what happens there. Cause obviously if you can get into that, if you can get into playoffs, you never know what happens. Um, it's, it's a crab shoot from there. Well, thanks so much for your time. Looking forward to seeing you here uh, in a little bit. We'll catch up with you when you get into camp. Okay. Sounds good. That's Jay Dickman. Thanks so much. Thunder nation until then enjoy the rest of your day.